What's going on guys and welcome back to Callison Fishing. Today is tournament day. A seven hour tournament from start to, lines in at 7 a.m. lines out at 2 p.m. Uh, fishing the Kalamazoo River today and if you guys watched my fall video, meaning the Kalamazoo River video I made in the fall back in September, me and my dad are fishing this tournament today and we're back at the same place. We're in the new Richmond County Park fishing. Kind of, It's kind of near Saugatuck, I guess. And we're kind of furthest, fishing the furthest away, almost uh, possible. It's misting out right now. We drove through some thunder and lightning and rain on the way here I'm hoping we can catch some decent fish today especially with smallies so it's a three fish limit today minimum that a fish has to be is 12 inches hope you guys enjoy this video and uh, stay tuned to see how we do we'll be on the water hopefully soon one minute warning try and start off throwing this frog a little bit just because it looks good we got a lot of fish jumping but there are a lot of them are carp figured I'd give it a try I had it tied on that doesn't work immediately switching to the swim bait but paddled up from our launch just a little bit lines in it's 7 a.m. Once again. We are fishing, fishing in the, the Jackson kayak today. It's kind of more my river kayak because I can get decently shallow with it. Seriously? One just jumped right there. Got one. Largey. No, I don't think so. Yeah, you're not 12 inches. First one. Too bad he wasn't 12 inches or else we'd have a fish on the board. Hopefully there's a big one in here that can chomp this thing. The one on. Swim. I don't even think he was eight inches. But he choked it. He freaking choked that thing. You can't tell me there's not a better. Oh, that was a blow up. Yeah, I think it was. It missed it. I don't know if it was my eyes playing tricks on me or if it was an actual blow up. Ended up being really windy, so paddled out of this little backwater area and continued down the river trying to find some fish. color? Blue, that black with the blue tip tail. Oh. You say cloudy days, blue and black. Good one? 
it's a measure. Oh, hooks out. I'm in trouble, it's in my hand. Woo. Hey, hey, you stay. That was a close one. Yeah. I don't know if you measure. I got another one. That's non measure. Number three. There's one. Come on in the boat. Cool, 13. He wanted back in the kayak, I guess. Oh, one had it. Got one. Nice one. Come here, bud. No, you're too big. I got a decent one. I got a good one. Oh, yeah, that's one we need right there. He won't coming off. The better one, definitely. That'll fill the limit. Cool. 14 and 3 quarters. That fills our limit. Thank you, buddy. After catching that largemouth, really started to struggle finding any bass. Found this really nice backwater with some weeds and some timber, but nothing really prevailed in there except for this big fish. Did you go very much further back in? Yeah. I got a good one. Yeah. I haven't seen it yet. Oh, that looks like it's, it's pulling drag here. I don't know if it's a bass. Oh, I don't have a choice right this second. Ah. 
Jeez, it's deep. Gotta be a fight. Yeah. All right, let it pin you. Just watch the rod behind you. He's under this tree. It's got to be a big ass northern. Catfish. Oh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> it's a big fat. Get out from under that tree. I can't believe it hit that. What do you got, Sunday Sanko. I can't believe it hit the Sanko. Could be able to get him? I don't know if I can ever get him up. He's not giant, he's just fat. No. It's probably at least 10. I'm whooped. <laughs> Got your trees. I know you're good, but... Alright, I'm not taking them out of the net. There you guys go. Giant freaking cat. There it is. Rock bass. Oops. Well, there he goes. After hooking that rock bass, a long time went by before we caught another bass. Um, a few hours actually. It was a really big struggle and fishing a lot of the same water that I had hooked a lot of smallies in and just couldn't find anything going on.
got one. I thought that was a bite. Good thing I set the hook. Choked it. Got to beat my 12-incher, which... Nope. We ended up getting back to the launch early and decided to get out and head on into the check-in event. So to wrap up our tournament, you guys just saw the results. Um, 21st place out of 42 anglers, so exactly halfway uh, in the in the field of anglers, which is not bad. I mean, we did all right, but we were one of the last people with a limit. Like I had one of the smaller limits before people didn't even get a limit, which I mean, I, I had fun catching those fish in the, right off the bat, and but then we just, the bite shut off or something. I, a lot happened, I think. I mean, we had that weather front that went through in the morning. Um, I definitely know that stirred up the fish. The river was really warm when I stuck my hand in it. So I don't know if that just affected the smallmouth that much. I mean, the smallmouth were in there. They just weren't but not biting. We lost our cloud cover. I mean, it was cloudy most of the morning until I don't know what time we lost our sun, but probably 11, 11.30ish, we lost our clouds. I guess I'm trying to say, and then the sun popped out. I don't know if the bite shut off or not. I mean, the smallies just were not biting. The largemouth were, which was kind of weird being that last fall. And that one, guys. As you guys saw, I caught pretty much only smallmouth, maybe one or two largemouth, and that was it. So but this time around, quarter. just couldn't find just couldn't find the smallies. So I don't know what was up with that, but I mean, my dad even said, you know, on the trip home and whatnot, we're like, we're gonna fish some other body of water. Um, that's attached to the Kalamazoo River going forward for this for these events. Um, there's another one on June 22nd. But yeah, I caught everything on a swim bait. Um, I think I was using a quarter ounce uh, head. It was a trocar hook. I can't remember what the heck the specific name on it is. It was pretty much almost the exact same setup I caught them on in the fall. And then I caught the big catfish on a wacky and I caught the rock bass on a wacky too, I believe. As far as that goes, uh, right now the next derby video will be more than likely the Saginaw River event um, for the Tri-Cities League for Topwater Series. If that doesn't get postponed because right now they're calling for thunderstorms, but we're still a little bit of a week like under, just under a week out from that event lots of content that's coming for you guys i know this video probably came out quite a bit after this event happened but i'm just trying to spread out content so they have enough content going into the fall and into the winter for you guys to still be able to watch and like that's new and i can post and whatnot so that's kind of the plan but yeah it's gonna do it guys i i really appreciate you guys watching the videos um i really appreciate um all of you that are subscribing lots of new subscribers as of late um at least when i'm recording this video so um really appreciate you guys watching stay safe out there get outside get on the water and go catch some fish and we'll see you guys next time.